Well, this is Guns, Knives, and Watches, and one of the coolest little tools, and you can probably buy this under a lot of different names, this, there, or the other. This is the one under the, the Kershaw brand name, and it has their, uh, their logo, their stuff, and this was probably given out at a trade show. But it's just a little aluminum tube with a magnetic bit holder. You can take off the back, and it's got three bits in it that are some of the most common knife you know bits that I've actually come up with to use these are smaller they're a little more reduced in size in that axis let me show you one that's actually full size oh lord see they're reduced in size they're this there or the other um, just to fit into this device this is the coolest little apparatus though have I ever put it on my keychain? No. Do I use it like that? No. But it's pretty cool. It's got two torques. Uh, it's got one Phillips. And uh, it's just a quality made tool. The shaft and the head, and this probably you're not supposed to do this, you're not supposed to be able to do this, it's supposed to be some epoxy or something, are all screwed together. Um, everything's threaded it's not some just total piece of crap is it probably made in China yeah it probably is um, but it's a really cool tool you can probably pick it up for you know whatever like I said it's probably sold under a bunch of different brands but this one's from Kershaw handy little piece of kit and uh, you know if you if if weight is an issue to you you can take off this link and all that crap and just put your uh, put that on there and you know kind of rock out but what the swivel does it allows you to keep it on your keychain and actually use it uh, and actually you know use it man um, like I said I don't use it that way but it is a cool tool the reason I'm saying that is because this is the Spyderco Endura G10 um, and of course, I bought these for like 50 some bucks to see our trading post. Uh, you're going to learn that that is a theme of mine, is value shopping. I buy everything that no one else wants or is being discontinued or this, that, or the other. Um, and when I was able to buy them, of course, I bought not just one, not just two, not just three or five or six and these are just some of the uh, samples that are just not in use right now it is a very very useful uh, knife made in America uh, made in Japan Seiki City Japan BG 10 um, this there or the other and if you buy it like I said I paid 50 bucks or something like that for these knives I think they originally sold them at discount for well, they sold them at street price was around 130. Of course, they've got the bird. Um, this is the bird, whatever the hell this is. Might be a Caracara, might be something else. I don't know. It's the same size as the Endura. You can look at the specs. The only difference is um, you can choke up on it, and it doesn't have the spidey hole. It's got this, there, or the other. And the uh, blade material is 8CR13MOV. But it's not a bad knife. Um, you know, for right now, it's probably a good value. It, you know, carrying that knife says I'm a, you know, I basically am a, a worthless piece of shit communist who probably shops a lot at Walmart. But uh, other than that, you know, it, it's not a bad knife. And there's a lot of piece of shit, this, there, or the other. People rag on me all the time about some of the stuff that I've got. And it's like, well, you know, if you bought American and you actually supported people in your own country and this, there, or the other, instead of trying to go undercut them and, and go to go to Walmart or go this, there, or the other and buy a bunch of foreign-made shit. And I know these knives are made in Japan. They're not made in the United States. But Japan you know is not China Japan doesn't have a culture that you are a worthless piece of shit barbarian which the Chinese do 
and that's my one big problem with this knife is this knife the quality and this there or the other and, and does it have some features and some da 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 as far as availability price um, you know craftsmanship is not bad da, does it have all of those features yeah it's got all of those features but you're supporting people that think you are a worthless piece of shit barbarian because they sit back and they you know you're either one of them or you're a barbarian that's real shit that's the way the game's played so if you it's a good knife it's a good value it's good this there or the other if you're gonna buy some Chinese shit buy it just as cheap as you possibly can um, I have bought American made and Japanese and and a few other knives uh, I don't really get into the high-end Seiko's or the high-end Spyderco's that are made in like Taiwan and this there or the other and I don't buy into all that hype and bullshit because in reality you're supporting a lot of people that think you're a worthless piece of shit barbarian why would you do that uh, and who all they want to do is, is and that's my big problem with things like this I'd rather buy a Spyderco that's made in in you know Japan uh, than you know this piece of shit which is a model one uh, from you know it's back before when Randall was actually involved with this deal uh, back before they were you know left Ontario because Ontario basically uh, stole their name and they had to change it over to SA or S whatever the hell they call it I don't really care um, but this kind of signifies that you're a worthless piece of shit too um, but you know good knife for what it costs this there or the other but it says you have no refinement no this there or the other don't care about anybody and you're going to basically support the enemy you know it, it's 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 almost it, it's actually insane when you really think about it on a global scale of what we have actually done uh, as far as putting the American worker out of the workforce doing all of these things and supporting people that their only ambition in life is to destroy us it, it's kind of oxymoronic but they make some cool little tools like this little Kershaw thing. You know this thing's made in China because it's, you know, it's just not the quality. It's not this there or the other. You're, you're not, you know, getting the best tool in the world. But at least it's not that, it's not some just worthless crap either, you know. You can use full-size bits with it. You can use this. You can do that. You can load them out. It's pretty universal other than the fact that, you know, these bits, as I said, were the shorter size so that you can get three of them in there but it's not you know it's not bad made I think Benchmade might make something like this a lot of companies might make it and it doesn't scream out I'm just I hate you know basically this there or the other because I've heard a lot of people get on these things and they go well I don't care where something's made you know just as long as they've got the quality yeah that's true if I hate to sit there and say that they didn't view you as an enemy. That's why Ch Chinese hackers hack us, because they view us as the enemy. They view us as lesser than, and we may be lesser than. Our civilization is, is much newer. Are this there or the other? Da 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 da. But that's what these products right here scream out. That I, you know, basically. I'm a worthless piece of shit and I'm selling out to the enemy. People talk about traitors and talk about those kind of people and, and people who, who go against their own uh, you know, government, their own concepts, their old I own ideas, or you know, double agents, people who do things like that. And they're the enemies in the movies. But yet we make those choices on a daily basis when we buy the things that we buy when we do those things we are actually that person and I know I started this whole video off talking about this cool little tool and uh, this one's from Kershaw and then we talked about the spider codes and da 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 but you've got to understand that that's the reality you vote with your dollars you vote with your uh, you know choices in life that is a vote. That is the same as when you go to the ballot box. That is the same when you do anything in your life. You know, 
you're voting sometimes when you buy this stuff from China, you're voting for people that hate you and who believe that you are lesser than and you are the barbarians, which we may be, but human rights are human rights. This is Guns, Knives, and Watches. Have a good one.